Oh, oh, oh. Careful not to work yourself to death there, Uncle. I was thinking. Yeah, does it pay well? Oh, eventually. So, while the rest of us are busy stealing, killing, lying, fighting to try to survive, you get to think all day. Well, it's a strange world we live in, Arthur Morgan. Hey, you want to head into town? See if we can find anything out? Sure. I got some errands to run. Great. Go check the horses are ready. <sighs> If you gonna take the old man into town, you can take us too? Well, what you got planned? Nothing. We'll find something for y'all to do. We always do. We're bored out of our minds. Been cooped up here for two weeks now. Karen's about ready to murder Grimshaw. <laughs> well, can Miss Grimshaw spare you? <sighs> can Miss Grimshaw spare you? What's happened to you, Arthur? Three young, healthy women want you to take them a robin. You're worried about house chores. Let's go. Fair enough. You got me. Come on, then. <laughs> I can't believe we're going to see civilization. Feels like weeks since we did. Yeah, Valentine. <laughs> Very embodiment of civilization. <laughs> ladies are going to love it. Okay, then. Let's go. All right. Out through the trees here, then take a left. All right, we got some young ladies on our wagon. Let's see where we going. Okay, uh, let's see. All right, nice. Or this is not for the wagon. It's not like a car, like. Okay, so you just press X and X. It's sometimes I get confused, you know. I think like you gotta drive it like a car with the R2, but you don't. I think we're going to the. Close village that is here, which is Valentine. Holy crap, they're freaking horses. Well, that's what happens. You didn't do it right. You gonna get that fella's horse? Well, I got lumbago. Very serious. Not gonna do that. It's too much work. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Move, 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 move. Oh, you wanna head into town? Yes, but this won't take long. Look at the poor fella. Why didn't you help that poor man? Oh, lumbago. It's really serious. It can be deadly. You, Arthur. Do I look like I got the energy to waste on charity? Holy crap, I almost freaking crashed with the train. I don't believe you're quite that cold, Mr. Morgan. Got some car mine there. Realize I feel bad I didn't rob and kill the bastard. <laughs> Very inspiring, Arthur. Woo! Smell those sheep. <laughs> Or is that uncle? <laughs> I gotta turn around here. Holy crap. This looks like a decent... This don't feel right, Arthur. Feels like the wrong direction. This looks like a decent little town. Other people. Finally. Look at all, all right, let me see. snow on the mountains. Sure don't want to be back up there. You think we should have asked Molly to come with us? Oh, no. Miss O'Shea is far too high and mighty now for the like of us. Ladies scare a little bit too much, work. man. She's a society lady now. Yes, sir. You can pick up some bounties there, Arthur. Heaven forbid you put your head on the line. Yeah, well, that's a young man's game. <laughs> Ooh, yes. We can get up to some mischief here, all right. Just remember, keep a low profile. Will you remember that, though, Arthur? Probably not. Let's park up down the end there, near the stables. Just like I said, the cultural center of civilization. <laughs> Man at his finest. Uncle, what are we doing? 
Well, we're gonna do what any self-respecting maniac does. Put the women to work. <laughs> With pleasure. We'll start at the saloon. Okay, just stay out of trouble. Don't get yourselves noticed. Right, I need to get something from the stores. Okay, well, we'll see you at the general store when you're done. Come on, ladies. Imagine we're in Paris. Come on. So that's how you see yourself, is it? A maniac? Well, in my youth, I used to be known as the one-shot kid. <laughs> okay. I'm not gonna ask why. You are a sad man, Arthur Morgan. But I know you love me. Desperately. You're my favorite parasite. No. Ringworm's my favorite parasite. You're my second favorite parasite. Very funny. I lied. Ringworm, then rats with the plague, then you. Shut up. This is the place now. Come on. Morning. So, what do you need? Hell, a drop of whiskey for a start. You know, something to pass the time while we're waiting on the women. Always thinking ahead, ain't you? They got some nice jerky here, and you look like you could use some energy, Arthur. Let me know if you have any questions, fellas. Whiskey's on the top shelf, nearest the door. Salt of beef. Let's see, examine. What does this give me? Mm. You're not getting anything, Arthur? Uh, I don't know. Maybe. Salmon. Now, this is what I need. I'm buying this. Over here, we got corn. So, you're actually buying for once? Are you feeling all right? See this? Young folk got no respect for their elders. What is no this? Permian cigarettes? Lamb or the sausage? Uh, well, this here's a sheep town. The lamb's the best in the state. Let me get one of this. Is. I want to see what oh, this does. Right. Let's see. Hair pomade. All right. Let's see what I can sell. Well, look at this. A jaw harp. What is this oh. list of yours? I got it's a lot, a lot to of things. After that god awful time in the mountains. Oh, All done. Oh, yeah. Thank you kindly. Okay. Ah, <laughs> this should do the trick. Yep, that's fine whiskey. Where's the hair pomade? Let me see. I'm guessing it's somewhere here. That should do us. Let's go wait for them outside. Oh, here's to your good health, sir. <laughs> and to being down here off that mountain. Absolutely. It's a funny world, you know. This time in my career, I pictured myself being married to an heiress. Gentlemen. <laughs> I think I got something good. What? What? I snuck into this fancy house. Acted like a servant girl. Usually works. Someone was saying her sister was taking a trip from New York or someplace. Train full of rich tourists heading to San Dene and then cruising off to Brazil. Okay. A train laden with baggage and passing through a bit of deserted country at night. As to get to the docks in time for the tides. In some place called Scarlet Meadows. Yeah, I know it. Yeah, yeah, it's right out in there, New Hanover. <laughs> right, it's real quiet out there. Sounds good. Uh, Where's Tilly and Karen? I think at the hotel. They were picking up some drunken fellas that they was gonna rob. Why? It seemed easy. They have been gone for quite a while. I guess I'll go see if there's any trouble. Oh, there's Tilly over there. That does not look ideal. Excuse me. You can go kiss a damn snake for all I care. Get off me! Get off of me! I've been looking all right, let's see. Ah, we got the the classic one. Uh, intervene. Get your hands off her. Who are you? A friend of mine. Get the hell off of her, you son of a bitch. Hey, hey, take it easy. 
There's no problem here. There will be if you don't get out of here right now. The big mistake, Tilly Jackson. Just get lost. I ain't doing this with you right now. Can I kill him? Can I like punch him? Oh! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Holy crap, yo, what the hell just happened? Get your hands off me. You thought I wouldn't find you. Oh my lord, I wanted to kill him or punch him at least. I can't do that. I've been looking too Diffuse. Where's see, let's see, let's see, let's see the diffuse one. Who are you? A friend of mine. Get off her. <laughs> or what exactly? You wanna find out? Yeah, that's right, boy. That's right, boy. Making a big mistake, Tilly Jackson. Oh, uh, Tilly Jackson is here and she's safe. Go right. away with Uncle and Mary Beth. They're closest to me. Okay. Thanks, Arthur. Uncle! Look after her. I'm gonna go see about Karen in the hotel. Seems like a big a village of full of problems. Let me see. I think I gotta go inside, I think, yeah. Let me see. Can I go in here? Oh yeah. Yeah. Yep, I can go here. Let me see. Let me eat this. No trouble now, please. friend of hers get out of here buddy i paid they paid a hitter you goddamn animal come here did i kill him what the hell are you doing trying to play him not very well you okay fine you sure yeah nothing i think nothing i killed well. him Just men but Stupid bastard. Stupid bastard was boasting about the bank. The bank? Sure, I know small town banks are usually a waste of time, but this is a livestock town. There's lots of cash sometimes. Okay. Keep investigating. I will. I hope uh, everything's okay up there. After you. Thank you, Arthur. I don't much like being saved, but when I have to be. I understand. You okay? Sure. He only punched uh, me. Arthur punched him a lot harder. Yeah. All right, then. Hey, who's that guy over there looking at us? Weren't you in Blackwater a few weeks back? Me? No, sir. Ain't from there. Oh, you were. Well, I definitely saw you with a bunch of fellers. Me? No. Impossible. Listen, buddy. Come here for a minute. I saw you. Come here. Cool. Get I don't like this. Me neither. Go get the girls home. I'm gonna go have a word with our friend. Be careful, Arthur. Just a word. Yeah. Just a freaking word, boy. I'm gonna catch him. Just born. I'm gonna catch you. I'm gonna catch you. Oh, he thinks he's the fucking Reaper. Crushing the freaking bridge like that. Move. Where he at? Oh, right there, right there, right there, right there. Oh, oh.
You fell down. Can I catch him like with my uh Can I catch him with my lasso? Let's see. Oh shit. Holy crap. He's dead now. Well he fell down. I didn't I don't I didn't really kill him. You saw that guys, he fell down. I didn't kill him. What the hell? Let's see, let's loot his body. He has everything. He has something, he's hiding something. Oh, it's over here he fell down. Oh right there, right there, I see him. Okay, let's see. Alright, look at his body. Let me see. Mm, he got two dollars. Alright, nice, nice, nice. At least it's something. I expect nothing from him. Well, I expected him nothing from him. Alright, let's see. Um, Let's do this one. GE right here. Hitch horse. Wow, this is a new house that they're building. What do I? What am I doing here? Oh, it's inside here. G. to meet you. Well, ain't you just a tough as teak mountain man? Oh, you be quiet, Anastasia. Anyone <laughs> can tell this one is a pussy cat. Exactly. Yes, he's a pussy cat. And that's so worth her. Whatever you say. How much you cost, anyway? Well, ain't that a nice way to talk to a lady? Oh, I didn't know I was talking to a lady. Excuse me. <sighs> well, I must say... You got a fine way with the women, amigo. Yeah, regular dandy and a charm. <laughs> Where's Bill? Oh, man. I dread to think about it. Hey, hey, hey. hey there he is. Watch where you're going. Take it Are easy, you about pal. to kiss that guy Take or punch him? Huh? Oh, oh, and we have our answer. <laughs> yes! Yeah! Ah! This guy. Let's get this big guy. 
Oh my god, bro. Let me grapple this guy. Oh, shoot. Come on, he's beating my fucking ass. Damn, am I supposed to lose this? Surely that's enough. What business is it of yours? <laughs> no business. <clears throat> no business, sir, but please, I beg you. Making new friends again, I see, Arthur. <laughs> Look who we found sniffing about. Josiah Trelawney. The very same. Well, well I thought you'd gone to New York. And miss all this glamour. You must be joking. How are you? Well, quite well indeed. I went to Blackwater looking for you gentlemen. You're not very popular there, it seems. Ah, Javier and Charles. I've missed you. And Bill looking as well as can be. Gentlemen, always a pleasure. You're right. We ain't too popular in Blackwater. We left a lot of money there. And young Sean, it seems. Sean, you found him. Yes, I have. He's being held by some bounty hunters, trying to see how much money the government will pay them. I know he's in Blackwater, but there's talk of them moving. Well, if we step foot in Blackwater... Uh, ah! Well, then we're dead men for sure. There'll be Pinkertons all over the place, but if he's alive, we gotta try. Yeah, of course. It's you they want, Dutch. Always is. Charles, go find out what you can, carefully. Josiah, take Javier. Arthur, go get yourself cleaned up. Join them when you're ready. Well, what about me? Well, exactly. What about you? What does that mean? Oh, Bill. Come on. Yeah, damn, we, we did fall like freaking savages there. We fought with honor. We freaking honor. All right, it's time to go. <laughs> Talking too much crap in here, bye.